This week on London Real, we have the English rapper, poet, and journalist, Akala. If I didn't go to Pan-African Saturday School, if I didn't grow up in that empire, if I didn't listen to Wu-Tang forever or read the autobiography of Malcolm X when I was nine, would I be the person I am today? Probably not. One too many men that could have been doctors and not spending the whole life boxed up. Hip hop was my life, it was something I lived, I loved interacting with it, I wrote lyrics every day, I was in battles. Cause to me all they do is breed conflict. First time I saw someone get stabbed, I was 12 and it was a little poke, it was a meat cleaver in the back of a guy's head. I had other teachers that felt that a person from my racial, cultural, economic background, and certainly from my socio-economic background, should not have been top of the class. These were guys who were doing well in the street, but they'd spent so much of their life in and out of prison, etc. But they were like, you don't want to be like us. You know, you're, you're clever. In fact, if you drop out of school, we're going to give you a hiding. Yeah, they say you are British and that lovely patriotism they feed you. But in reality, you have more in common with immigrants than with your leaders. If the music is good enough, if the visual is good enough, if your online interaction is decent, you can keep your integrity and have a career. If we're honest, true strength is the strength to be honest. Ultimately, any power structure in the world wants to stay powerful. London Real presents Akala. Knowledge is power. It's fear. But at, at, at 20, you can't admit it's fear. 